How's it going guys? Today we have Marvel's White Rabbit from Marvel Legends. Check it out. Look at the side art. Let's look at the back. Pretty cool. So this is a lady. Let's see. Let's see what the synopsis says. So a brilliant woman a brilliant woman with the twisted mind, Dr. Lorena Dodson, is the deranged queen of crime, the White Rabbit. So guys, basically who she is, is kind of like, from my understanding, is if the Joker and Harley Quinn had a baby, this lady would be it. So guys, this lady, she was kind of crazy, you know. She actually, at the age of 25, she married a... And she married an old guy who was 82 years old and then after that she actually killed him because she wanted his inheritance so with all the millions that she inherited she actually created an, an, a criminal enterprise and she created a whole bunch of weapons and gadgets and she actually created a a rabbit drone killing machine or kind of like rabbits that are robots but equipped with heavy machinery which is kind of crazy if you think about that um and where she got the inspiration from that was actually she went to the library and she saw one of her favorite books which was alice in wonderland so she got the inspiration from alice in wonderland because of the rabbit she also had an umbrella that used to shoot bullets and carrots or fire or something i don't know i don't remember very well so after that there was two goons in new york city who were wanted by the police she actually apprehended them and told the mayor or the police that she wanted one billion dollars for the ransom for turning them in so what the mayor did he told her i will give you an offer you can't refuse and he actually insulted her by saying i'm gonna pay you two dollars and fifty cents which was which was ridiculous if you think about it i mean two dollars and fifty cents really so what does she do she went to new york and she bombed new york city and uh well she created a bomb and she bombed new york how about that and then she raised her her ransom price to five billion which was crazy so after that spider-man shows up web slinging you know fighting and everything and he actually rescues those two goons those two criminals and they kind of flee off the city after that she actually became a narcotics dealer so she she was actually a drug dealer which was crazy i'm telling you this lady's crazy what happened was she actually got apprehended for selling drugs and then she went to court so on the day of court she actually had a fake toy gun on her and she showed it to the to the judge and the judge had a heart attack so she killed the judge somehow at court she managed to get that robot rabbit which is a giant rabbit that she rides on she manages to get the rabbit inside of the building you know destroy the building and kind of like rescue her so after that she went to a burger joint and then she wanted a burrito <laughs> and, and they didn't serve her a burrito or something like that and then she went inside and kind of beat up the clerk or the manager or something like that i don't know but she got she assaulted someone over a burrito and then i believe she got captured or something um no there was this other villain who was i think he was his name was craven he, ha he actually shot Jessica Jones and White Rabbit at the same time, but Jessica Jones did not die and White Rabbit was supposed, supposedly was dead, but she actually was alive. Okay, so long story short, basically by the end, her and her two friends that were in her gang were fighting off who was spider-man but he was the miles morales spider-man and then she actually at the end fought the real spider-man 
who actually was able to defeat her at the end and then he apprehended her and he took her into custody and took her to prison or whatever so basically that's kind of what happened but yeah this <laughs> this lady is kind of crazy all over the place so anyways let's just go ahead and open her up and let's check let's check out what we have okay so let's go ahead and open her guys let's see what we have in stock main character right here let's take out this first this is kind of like a stand man look at this sick dragon right here so that's a dragon pretty cool it has like some weird texture on it it's very plasticky but very almost kind of like almost kind of like gummy it kind of feels good though weird but it feels good in the hands i don't know instructions nobody reads that check out the main character she looks very, very cute this is a cute little doll right here her inspiration was alice in wonderland let's get, let's get that umbrella so we got the umbrella check it out so this is supposed to be like you know the the fire and bullet i guess she also made like razor sharp knives that would shoot out of the umbrella as well but unfortunately they don't come in the package i don't remember why the dragon is in here so the dragon i'm guessing it goes like right here so the dragon kind of goes like that there's like a hole on there there's a hole right here and then i'm guessing this little ball joint goes in there to be honest i'm not even sure but i'm gonna try it anyways we'll see if it fits hopefully i don't break it okay yeah so it does fit in there it's in there this actually looks pretty cool i mean if you pair it up with like a, a light or something it would probably look pretty cool like with a light source some type like in a display and a light man that would look cool let's put the umbrella on her hand well actually let's check if she has articulation and all that the hair is very 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 hard so let's see so she can only do left and right left and right so left and right and then let's see up and down oh up and down yeah she can't she can't do up and down she won't be able to say yes or no oh wait wait a minute yeah it does it does do up and down a little bit uh very minimal but it does do it okay so let's check the arm the arm is full rotation let's see the the hand okay yeah swivels all the way the elbow is only one it's not double jointed it's just one joint and it only it's only able to do like a, a 90 degree so this one is also not double jointed single joint and this one you can also just do a 90 degrees as well it won't go any farther than that just 90 degrees is all it can do and then she has a cape a cape that is very it, it feels very rubbery it feels kind of like a rubbery this is how she looks from the back oh her boots her kind of like fur boots you know they're like polar white they look kind of to be honest they're kind of ugly for me but i don't know maybe there's girls that like this but i don't like them anyways and then so let's check out her feet there's no articulation on the feet very minuscule uh, it doesn't okay so it does go down they do go down like a little bit and then they go up see go up and down but they don't move left to left or right they don't move left to right just very slightly okay the knees are actually double jointed if she wanted to kick you with her knees she can so on the knees it can actually go like all the way back look at that little watch right there that looks kind of cool i kind of wish that came off i kind of wish it came with more accessories to be honest maybe like a little rabbit or drone rabbit her other weapons that i read about i don't know it, just the umbrella seems kind of very basic I would have liked a little bit more accessories or maybe even different set of hands or something okay so let's do a stand-up test it's kind of a little bit hard to stand her up because most of her weight is on the jacket like on this like blazer there it is let's put the umbrella on on her hand let's see what she looks like with the umbrella both of the hands are the same so you can put it in either or that's kind of how she looks with the umbrella like she's about to attack like a villain or something I kind of wanted to angle it that way, you know, kind of like like attacking someone or something, like shooting at someone. Looking pretty good. She's kind of cute looking and everything. The face painted like a cat in the face. 
the color of the um, the color of the skin I kind of wish it was a little bit more lighter it's kind of dark I don't know it doesn't come through on the on the camera but it's kind of dark I kind of wish it was a little bit more lighter most people hadn't even heard about this lady before I honestly didn't even know who she was I had to read up on her but yeah I mean she's kind of cool she's kind of cool looking let's see so kind of like that or what? let's see I'm, I'm I'm thinking maybe she goes right here or something I don't know okay there it is so it kind of okay wait a minute so i'm not sure if it goes like this or what but the dragon actually comes with like two spacers right there where her arms are through i don't know if that's how she's supposed to be posed like kind of like she's like on top of the i guess maybe she's supposed to be like that she's like flying on top of it or something kind of like she's on top of the dragon this actually doesn't look that bad so yeah maybe that's how she goes i'm not sure look at the back if anybody knows if this is how she goes, let me know. <laughs> if not, I have no idea if she goes like that. Um, it doesn't mention it on the like on the package or anything, but it does have those two sl those two holes on there. I didn't know if those two holes were like her to put her arms through there, or if she was, or if therefore like maybe the um, like this right here. But then again, I don't see how that would make sense. It doesn't add up. Maybe it's backwards. Hold on. Wait a minute. So like that. But then again, how would how would she go on there or what? Like, oh wait a minute. Maybe she goes on top of it or something. I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Does she go like this or or what? I I don't think this is how it goes. I think it goes like with her arms on there. This kind of doesn't make any sense. So let's see. So I'm gonna put it back in here. Hopefully I don't break it. Okay, there, it's in there. So this actually makes more sense. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, there it is. I think we got it. She basically goes on top of the, the dragon and then you have to just extend her legs. I think this is how it looks. I, I think this is how it should look. I'm not sure, but let us know down in the comments if this is how it looks. I think this, this looks a little bit more like it makes more sense. You can kind of pose her like that, maybe with the umbrella. It looks kind of rad, huh? So check it out. So like, she's kind of like flying. It looks kind of cool, to be honest. Okay guys, so that's gonna wrap it up. I think this is how it goes. It should go like that, I think. It would, it would make, it makes more sense like this. So there you have it. it makes more sense like this. Okay, so update this is actually not how she goes i feel so dumb i don't know if you guys can see that but it's right there um i mean honest mistake i had no idea i'm kind of, i'm actually kind of new to marvel legends so i don't really know marvel legends that well as you can tell obviously doesn't she look cool though look at that why rabbit wish she had that dragon on her flying her everywhere, huh? Look at that. That looks sick, huh? So that's actually a build a figure, you know, piece. She doesn't, she obviously doesn't go like that, so. Okay, so she, and she goes like that right there. But then what is this for though? So this doesn't show what it's for. So maybe, okay, so this, both these, so both of these parts go f with the Demogoglin. So I'm just gonna put this back on there and then I'm just gonna leave it like that. And then whenever we, whenever we make both of the videos for the, the Vulture and which one is the other one? Shang-Chi, we'll get the, build the figures from those and build the Demogoglin. I'm still learning about all this. Be patient with me. I'm still trying to learn YouTube and editing and unboxings and all this. I'm kind of new to this, so I apologize if there was a mistake about this. I'm not a Marvel Legends collector. I usually collect more anime figures and statues, to be honest with you guys. So, like I said, the Vulture and shang chi on the next couple of days and then we're gonna be able to build the figure of the mogoglin my name is danny so now i'm just gonna have to post her like that just for fun what do you guys think about that now huh huh
You guys like that or no? You guys like that? Yes, no, maybe, yes, no, maybe. That should go in the bloopers. That should go in the bloopers, huh? Yeah, I know. Oh my God, I'm never gonna hear the end of this. <laughs> this goes on the demo goblin. This goes on the demo goblin. Oh my God, Danny, wake up. Maybe I just needed a coffee. I don't know. I'll try to drink. I'll try to drink some coffee next time. It is kind of late to the, right now. So, anyways, like I said, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Hope I see you in the next one. We're gonna be doing the next ones in a couple of days. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe, hit the bell so you can get notified. My name is Danny from E4 Toys. Give us a like and I'm signing out. See you guys later.